The House of Representatives has given the Governor of Central Bank of Nigeria, Gordon Emefile, uh, DG of Nimasa, Bashiu Jamo, and the National Security Advisor, as well as the Inspector General of Police, 72 hours to appear before its investigating committee or face the law. This comes after the agencies failed to appear or formally send a representative to defend their roles in the ongoing probe into the management of recovered loots, movable and immovable from 2002 to 2020. Details in this report. The hearing was meant to uncover the many frauds which have characterized recovered loots from 2002 to 2020. But the absence of all key invitees has stalled the hearing. However, their absence did not go down well with members of the committee. The only agency here is the Office of the Accountant General of Federation. And since we need them to, we need CBN to be present for us to deal with you, I don't think we'll be able to take you without the CBN being present. So I'm worried when they are invited and um, the National Assembly is taken for granted in a case like this. That's for a serious concern. And Mr. Chairman, distinguished honorable members, I want to appeal that this should not end here. If it amounts to raising the on the floor of the House, we should shut down the National Assembly. A motion was moved and passed by members given the Aaron chief executives 72 hours to appear before the committee or face the threat of invoking its constitutional powers against them. None of us always compromise our legislative duties. That's why we're here. And if they are not here and they refuse to send letters onto appeal, we are to we'll give another 72 hours that all the agencies invited to please, this time we are appealing. Ensure that the courts are fair. I want to move this as a motion that by Thursday we should appear before this committee. If they fail, Mr. Chairman, they are the chairman of this committee, I think the necessary provision of the constitution should be invoked. The committee adjourns till Thursday, the 10th of June, for the continuation of the investigation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.